There we go. Patchy Torres, man, playing Patchy Torres. We're I back, we're back. Hello. All this other good stuff. We're back. There we go. They'll be back with us as well. Good Robert morning. Maybe some cafe. Some cafecito. And then Patchy told me, hey, Robert, where's the tacos? I said, man, Patchy didn't have time for tacos, Patchy. I apologize. <laughs> no tacos. <laughs> Patchy, so anyways, um, you gave me a fun fact. I was just joking around with you and I told you, man, I got to go do my Christmas shopping at Dollar General. And you go, Robert... I don't go to Dollar General. I go to Dollar Tree. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and 99 cents store. <laughs> Patsy, has anybody ever seen you at the Dollar Tree and go, Hi, Patsy? Or do they acknowledge no. you? Or Well, they didn't. if they did, they didn't say anything. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe because I was so busy. <laughs> <laughs> Can you go, Patsy? What, what Patsy she doing She might throw here? us in the basket. Watch out. You know, Patsy has all this money. What's she doing at the Dollar Tree? <laughs> Taking all our taking all yeah, our shopping like ideas and gifts and everything. There. Anyways, um They're great for decorations too, you know that. Oh, it's great decorations. <laughs> balloons, balloons, balloons. Let me see here. I gotta cue something up here real quick. But anyways, Patsy, um give a big shout out to Rosemary Gomez, one of my sponsors. Hi on Rosemary. Radio. Good there morning. we go. Uh Rosemary comes uh by way of Odessa, Texas. She moved to San Antonio to get closer to the music and everything Aww, too. Oh, you see? We were talking about people coming <laughs> to San Antonio. Welcome. When I would chat with Rosemary, I would tell her because when she lived in Odessa, I would tell her, what bands go up there? Actually, you played up there, didn't you, a couple yeah. of years ago? And just recently, we did just a recently, West Texas Just recently, that's right, yeah. that's right. Mm -hmm. You were up in, o in Odessa or Midland, or is it kind of kind of like, uh, they're both the same? Was it Odessa or Midland? <laughs> 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 it was Midland, I think. Um... Let me see here. Let me get something racked up here. See, I, I was doing Patsy's coffee and I got thrown for a loop here on what I wanted to talk about. There we go. Yeah, Everybody I put so much sugar in it, right? Now it's too much sugar. Like more. No, 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 no. no it's no. good now. You know what? I made Patsy some coffee and she goes, um, sweet and low or equal or what? Yeah, yeah. Equal. So I put, I put a little bit of sugar and then I give her a coffee. Patsy goes, more sugar, Robert. Okay, Patsy, more sugar. <laughs> More, Robert, and a lot of cream, Robert. Like, man, Patsy, man. <laughs> <laughs> now, Patsy, um, i got to ask you, tú que vives aquí en San Antonio, mm -hmm. what are some of your favorite restaurants to go to? Maybe a taqueria, or what What taco places do you like going to? Well, I love Chacha's. And they, they Where's Chacha's? The Bandera Road? They closed down. Okay, right, the margaritas, and oh, all that, right? Yeah. Well, I love their, their enchiladas. They just had the best enchiladas. Oh my really? gosh! Really, the chachas. Oh, yes, but they they closed down. The Ruiz family they closed down. They closed them down. They had three for a while. I, I of course I love La Fogata. I haven't been there forever, Patsy. Oh, La Fogata. I love the La Fogata, and of course you know uh, my favorite soup is at Mi Tierra, Caldo de Mercado. Ooh, I gotta ask yeah. you. Okay, let's say you and your husband go to Mi Tierra. Y'all sit down. What do you order? What's your favorite plate? Caldo de Mercado. Really? I always get it. It's a giant bowl of, of this really rich chicken broth with giant things of, of white <laughs> chicken Giant things, giant things. Chunks of chicken and <laughs> avocado and tortilla strips and cheese. Aren't you getting hungry? All melted in a big bowl. <laughs> the veggies are so healthy. Okay. And, and there's no tacos here. <laughs> No, you just recently. Are you saying that because you didn't bring me tacos? You want to talk about restaurants and right, food? Hey, man. I'm feeling a lot embarrassed. Thanks, man. I'm, I'm all better with Let me drink my I'm, coffee. Hey, Patsy, anyway, how you doing, Patsy? I'm all better with Sado. Patsy, now you just recently performed at Market Square, and we were talking about you selling out some of the CDs you took over there. When you're at Market Square, is it an automatic or just sometimes when you have time that you'll go by Mi Tierra to go have your your dinner is it sometimes or never or just whenever sometimes we have but usually because we're because we're playing there and our our truck is full of equipment we don't want to stay there you know we want to get the stuff home because right. you know it's parked out there of course so because of that we usually you know i go at a different time to go eat at mi tierra or or uh pico de gallo or la margarita you know go to all those places but you know, we can't, we don't want to leave equipment in a car there. <laughs> and Patsy, you're very, yeah. I forgot about that. Yeah. Uh, when, when performers perform at Market Square, let me give you all a fun fact here, that a lot of people fail to realize, people just show up and they drink their beers and they're enjoying the show. They fail to realize the work that everybody goes through, not only to get your sound system in there, if you got to take it, but your instruments, mm -hmm. your, your, instruments. your releases, your CD Micro boxes. And yeah, microphones and everything, so... It's it can like, get pretty bad, of course, of course, and, and then you got 
Sometimes you'll get, you know, those pendejitos that are walking around, don't want to leave you alone, or, you know what I mean? Hey, Patsy! And, and you know, know, every time we play there, we always get invited to go eat. Oh, really? You know, you're like, let's go eat. I'd love to, <laughs> but, you know, we need to take the truck home. Patsy, let me ask you, um, there are so many good movies out there about singers, musicians, bands, etc. Do you have two or three favorite movies that you've watched and you really liked that, that was about a band, a singer, etc.? I haven't seen any lately, but I want to see the Queen Bohemian Rhapsody so bad. Really? I want to see that one because remember I was doing a lot of Queen, and I did Bohemian Rhapsody in my school show. That Mamma Mia, let me go. <laughs> and we did the whole song from the beginning, really? and we did a skit to it. And I would dress up like a like a little gangbanger, <laughs> and I would sing it during the school show, and people thought it was a guy because <laughs> I hid myself. I was wearing a cap and a hoodie, and I was holding a gun. And I, and I have my head down. But, but you know what, Patsy, that's the thing about you. It was fun. <laughs> There's a lot of women that wouldn't say, I'm not going to put myself looking like that. No, 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 I'm pretty and everything. I don't, but, Patsy, you, you, you'll do the Paul McCartney, and you'll have a gun, and you'll be all gangbanger and everything. Paul McCartney, I had to darken my eyebrows, take <laughs> Big my time. lipstick off. I, I was like, who in the hell? I said, no way, that can't be Patsy. No, no. <laughs> but, Patsy, it was a heck of a job. Thank you. The, it was really, really was, man. And it was, it was very, so fun. Very I love singing the Beatles. Yes. Now, Patsy, um, let me see here. I wrote on a couple of notes here because I don't want to forget to ask you anything. Um, down, but down, down. Now, oh, okay. He's pulled out the list. Uh oh. No, uh -oh. just a couple. I, I didn't want to forget. Ask me no questions. I'll tell you no lies. <laughs> Patsy, uh, it's Christmas time. Uh, what what are your favorite uh, places to go shopping? To go do your little Christmas shopping? Where do you like to go to? The malls, Walmart, Dollar General, what? the Cantera, <laughs> the Rim. Where do you like to go to? Ooh, you're getting really nosy, aren't you? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not being nosy. It's a shopping. It's... I guess I, I like Macy's and Stein, do Steinmart. Do you? Yeah, yeah. See, I'm I'm not a shopper whatsoever. But like I said, women. Well, see, I have a lot of. My, my sisters and nieces, you know, and they love clothes and stuff, and so I buy a lot of the stuff there for them. So, um, like, don't they all seem to be the same? Like, some people prefer North Star Mall. Some people prefer La Cantera. Some people prefer The Rim. Some people prefer Ingram Park Mall. Do you have a favorite mall, or, or you already got your, your store set where you like to go, and that's that, man. You're not going to go nowhere else. Because I have picked up people, and they like going to North Star Mall. They got tradition. They love going to North Star Mall. It's tradition. Maybe the memories I of it. I think when I lived in that area, I used to go there all the time. Did you ever go to Windsor Park Mall? Yes, I did. Way back. You Way remember back. that? Windsor Park uh, Mall? Yeah, I do. I remember wow, going man. there. Remember South Park Mall, which is still yes, there? Yes, yes, yes. Did you ever perform at Chelsea's? Yes, I did. At South Park Mall? Yes, I did. Under what band? Patsy Torres Band or I Blue Army? No, it was Patsy Torres Band. Because really? Because remember, we had that little... When the Patsy Torres Band started, we did a lot of rock. You know, that's why I was always wearing my spandex and my headbands and boots and gloves. And, you know, we were doing all the latest rock. Patsy, we have talked a lot about so many things. I think this is the third time we've gotten together for an interview. This time, uh, for the first time live. But we talk all the time. But we talk all the time. <laughs> me and Patsy are friends, no doubt. But let me just say this. Patsy, the other day I was playing one of your songs. And on on the, on the my website where it identifies your, your album cover, it puts it. On um, one of your songs, it put uh, your album cover of Trenzas. Oh. When you had your Trenzas. Oh, yeah. And, you know, Patsy, I got to tell you, man, I don't know who made you do that, but never again, Patsy. Joey. Joey, when they did the Trenza deal. If you, if, you, if you think I'm joking around or whatever, really, look up Patsy Torres, put Trenzas. So you don't and you have understand. one there, huh? No, I don't have one. No, I don't want that one. <laughs> do you know what's funny? People either loved it or hated it. Like, my parents hated it. And, uh, but then... People would come up, I just love your hair like that. And then they would come up with their kids, and their kids had the braids. And, and my daughter just had to have her hair just like that. And I, I wore trenzas for six months because we were promoting the album. Right. And I had to have it done every two weeks. And boy, it hurt. <laughs> they pull it so tight, you know, to make all the little trenzas. And every time they did it, it came out different. Sometimes it was all over to the side. Sometimes it was back this way, sometimes it was, they had bangs, sometimes it was, you know, it was different every time. But the thing about it was, and I was at Fiesta, Texas during this time, is when you have the trenzas like that, all the heat leaves off your head. All the what? The heat. The heat? You, you, like, you know, when I'm dancing and stuff and sweating? Yeah. Well, with, with the trenzas, 
you know, it's you've got all that open air because you can, you can, and the heat just leaves. <laughs> and, and I wasn't as hot and I wasn't as sweaty. And I could throw those little trenches around, and like, you know. And so it was awesome. Oh, man, man, man. I was like, yeah. Let's do some good morning shout outs. Good morning shout out going up to Mercy Perez Delgado. Mercy, hi. There we good go. Morning. There we go. Good morning, Mercy. How are we doing? Uh, Alicia Gonzalez. Hi, Alicia. There we go. También Jennifer Rodriguez. Good morning, Primo, Robert, and Patsy. Good morning, Jennifer. Uh, Mr. James Gonzalez. There we go. Hi, James. Sandra and Sinas. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, Sandra. There we go. Rosemary Gomez still with us. Joyce oh. Adragon Rivas. Some more oh, Rivas. We got a primo in the Rivas house. Are falling from the sky here. <laughs> Ray Figueroa. He's a Hi, musician. Ray. You know Ray, right? He I played with so. uh, mixtape. Yes. There we Hi. go. Guitar player. Good there morning. we go. Yeah. There's musicians awake right now. <laughs> <laughs> My primo Santiago Rivas Jr. says, Nombre, primo, you forgot the tamales for her or a couple of bonuelos. Tell him. I did. Tell him. Patsy, I'm sorry, Patsy, but that's, uh, you know, um, well, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be model and say, Patsy, you know, I only give that when people are right on time, Patsy. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Pump it, Patsy. Oh. Gotta go. That's it. I'm oh. done with you, Robert. <laughs> Uh, let me see here. Santiago Rivas, good morning. Manuel Rios, good morning, good morning, good morning. Debra Camarillo, Anaheim, California. Hi, Debra. There we Hi, go. California. That's right, California. Maria Lopez, Rosemary Gomez. Hi. There we go. Anyways, Patsy, um, we're going to, Pat, we got so many songs here to, to play. We're going to play two or three more, but I definitely, I've been playing the heck out of Santa Poppy. We you. talked about this about two years ago, something like that, but we got a lot of new listeners, a lot of people are joining us right now. Talk to me about Santa Poppy, and if you can. Can you it talk just, to me? it just in the voice. That one you day use. it just it. I started playing around because I uh, when I'm in the car I sing all the time and during Christmas, I sing every song that comes out. I sing every single song and whether I'm alone or with my husband or with anybody, I'm like ah, sing along. <laughs> so and sometimes no matter what the song is, I'll change the words or I'll I'll, I'll make them funny, and that happened with with Santa Puppy. I started just like <laughs> you know I start putting in my own words and then thinking. Santa Papi instead of baby. And then David, my husband, was like, that sounds really cool. I was like, huh. So I just kept doing it. And I, I wrote the, all the lyrics. And then I just imagined th this character singing Santa Papi. And then he was like, oh, Santa Papi. <laughs> and then my little character just came out. I need to do a video. I've already got the video in my mind. You don't have a video. I don't oh, have a video. Oh, man. Because it would be little. elaborate. No doubt. The video I have in my mind. A material girl? Kind of like that, but, like it, a material but it's girl? funny. It was sure. funny. The, the Latina kind of. Now, Santa Papi is more, not more aiming at the Hispanics, maybe the. It is Latina, because like the part where she it? says, I need Santa Papi, I need, a, I need a new red dress and high heels with class for Christmas Eve midnight mass. <laughs> I like how we go, orale pues. Yeah. Orale pues. It's so funny when I do that, everybody just laughs on that. It's it's a very it's an excellent. I've done it Christmas live song. and it's they just. I don't know why other radio stations are not playing it. Who, who is not? I don't know who's playing it. Who's not? I know I'm playing it. I Thank pound you. on it. But Patsy, I get so many responses from it. Every go, man, that's awesome. It's an awesome song. And it's an you. original song, and I applaud your efforts. It's very Thank very you. nice. Now, Patsy, you're saying that you're always singing or whatever. Um, do you go to sleep singing? Wake up singing? You're taking a shower singing? Do you? Is it always singing for you? Is well, it? I think sometimes, like especially at night, there's a there's a new original on this Christmas album called "I've Got That Christmas Spirit in My Soul," and that happened one night that I was just like, because sometimes you know, sometimes you can't sleep, and especially if you've been working in music and the, the music still keeps going through your head. And it was after I did, did the Patsy Cline shows and everything, and I'm, I'm trying to get all that music out of my head. And I started thinking about Christmas, and I was like, I want to write a song. And it just started coming. I, I started hearing the music. I was like, okay, I'm hearing the music in my head. It must have been 2 in the morning. And then, and then the lyrics started coming. I'm like, uh-oh, I got to just get up. And I just got up, and I just started writing. Because I said, if I go back to sleep, I'm going to forget it. So I started writing, and by morning, I had the whole song, and my husband's getting up. You know, and he's like, what are you doing? Go to sleep doing? already. Well, well, he'll say that. He'll say, go to sleep. I go, I'm writing a song. Oh, <laughs> he leaves me alone. He knows. And in the morning, I start singing it to him. He goes, hey, that's cool. But once he heard the actual production, then he was like, this is awesome. Now, before we put on Santa Poppy, we're talking about Patsy Torres' brand new Christmas CD, man. You got to get it. Now, Patsy, tell my people here who's listening or joining us, 
Where can they purchase the CD if they don't get to see you live? Where can they well, get it? If this? you're in San Antonio, you can purchase it at Janie's Record Shop over off of Bandera Road. She's got it. Okay. I will be at Walmart this Saturday, which is the... Is that the 17th? December 17th? The 16th. No, no. This Saturday? 13th, 14th, the 15th. Oh, the 15th. Well, Thursday, right? Thursday the 13th. 1450. Okay. Right, right. So I'll be there on Saturday and uh, I'll be at three different Walmarts throughout the day on the same day. In the morning, I'll be at the uh, Walmart at Summit Parkway at 10 in the morning. And then afternoon, I'll be at the Vance Jackson Walmart. And then early evening, I'll be at the Woodlawn Bandera Walmart. And I will have what's left of my CDs while supplies last. I'll sign them for you. I'll have a free picture for you. And I'm also going to sing a couple tunes live. Woohoo! Patsy the workaholic. Thank you to Walmart. Thank you. Patsy the workaholic. I'm telling you, Patsy, like but I, I said. I get to meet people and they get to hear my song. And Patsy, where do you get all this energy from? I was always hyper. I was hyper. Too. Really? You've always, you've always my, had this energy? They pulled out some old 8mm uh, video. Well, not video. It was movie. Movie film. And my brother was, was playing it. And it's, we're all little. And there's my dad all young and everything, <laughs> and all the kids there, and I'm just like running around like a squirrel, and I come up behind him, and I'm going, eh, 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 <laughs> <laughs> running around, I'm like, oh, my God. I didn't know I was such a brat. <laughs> I was like hyper, just, and you would just see a flash, <laughs> and all the other kids were sitting there with my, with my father and waving, and I'm running. And then making faces behind him, I'm like, oh my gosh. Good morning, shout out going out to uh, Stella Garcia. Good Hi, morning, Stella. good morning. Joel J. Gonzalez. Joel, my so, man. Says, hey, I am playing it. I am the first to play the whole album. Yes, Woo -hoo! He did. Thank Hilda you, Rosales. There we go. Stella Reyes. Good morning, good morning, good morning. There we go. Irby Ornales. Good morning. Jesse good morning. Gutierrez. Good morning. good morning. Sean Zam, Gonzalez, Texas. There we go. Good morning. There we go. Uh, Apache Robert Riva, Texas. There we go in the house. Cynthia Estrada. There we go in Mercy. There we go. I tell you what, let's go ahead and play. Santa Papi, and I'm going to go and uh, pick a second cut. We're going to take a break, and we'll be back to there play a couple go. more songs. Uh, good morning, Double R Radio, and I'm here with... Patsy Torres. Woohoo! I'm getting too excited here, Patsy. Good morning. <laughs> there we go. We're going to take a quick break. We'll be back for one more. It's the live uh, kind of a segment, whatever you want to call it. We'll be back in about five minutes. Orale, pues. Hang in there. Hang in there. Orale, pues. Orale, pues. <laughs> 